My name is Mark James Paul, and today we will be talking about Batman Cape Crusader. Um, it turns out there's some type of lesbian kiss, which I've seen in the episode, and um, it was kind of distasteful, you know, because now Harley Quinn is more of a lesbian than she is by. Like, over in the years, her, like, sexuality, it done shifted. Yeah, because up in the beginning she wasn't always uh bisexual and now they done did a 360 and they made her completely lesbian she has no type of 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 male partners anymore and they're mainly focusing on female um same gender lesbian partners and it's kind of getting out of hand and they just keep on pushing it keep on forcing it on the audience and me i've seen it it's good i like the animation but inclusion is 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 a big part of of the batman cape crusaders it's a big part like like it's a home it's a staple for um the agenda up in this batman animated series and like it's getting so out of hand that um it's like dang man hey, yo, but can we do something else something that's more like everything this show is highly diversity diversity to the max is pumping it and um and me um i understand in the in the cries and the backlash and like all that me i understand but, but just give the show a chance so then um um if you don't like it you don't like it and you don't have to force yourself to watch it but at least try to give it a chance just try but um overall man the, this it's okay it's it's all right um it's it's promoting diversity heavy and um and you and you as a as a consumer as the individual uh, just give it a try, man. We already know what Hollywood is doing, and they may say, oh, you're hate-watching. If it's true, it's true. I don't care what anybody say. If it's true, if they are doing it, and it's and it's evidence of that, you can speak about it. Like, I could care less about hey, but what people are saying. Oh, hey, you get a break, or ready, and all this stuff that we already know, man, that gay people exist, yes, but... And they keep on like shoving it down our throats and forcing us to consume these type of products. And like, it's like every time, like, oh my gosh, it's it's just the Hollywood. I mean, Hollywood is is just doing that to us. And like, I just don't know why, man. And they would say Harley Quinn has always been bisexual. Nope, not up in the beginning. I I never seen her having a girlfriend or or, or any of that. But people will cap to the extreme for this type of stuff. And um here it is. Me I already seen it but I'm it's sorry. it's a na There's it's an nasty bro. Nasty work. Oh. Nasty work. Tell you what. Meet me later at Hoppers on Wilson and Lau. Nasty work. We'll pick up where we left off. Nasty work. Nasty work. <laughs> That's the problem able with society now. And then up in the show, it promoted uh, strong women all the time. Strong women. Strong women. The whole entire series. And I watched it all. Ten episodes. And it promoted strong able women. And the man it wasn't that strong. So it was a whatever, though, man. I wanted to know you guys' thoughts and opinion about this LGBTQ kiss, this alphabet kiss. And my name is Marvin X Files. If it doesn't got that X, that's down. It's real. It is authentic. Marvin X Files. Two fingers. Peace out.